Hi guys, welcome back to my channel and welcome back to another video. Um, so in today's video, I am kind of going to be your guinea pig for buying denim. Now I know that denim can be so hard to buy, um, lots of different brands, you need to get different sizes, different leg lengths, all denim is different fit and things like that. So yeah, this is kind of going to be like a denim buying guide. I'm going to show you some of my all time favourites, try those on with you, show you how they fit. And I've also bought quite a few new pairs of jeans to try. I am a sucker for a good pair of jeans i'm always on the hunt for a new good pair of jeans especially in the spring i feel like winter i'm just like joggers all the time and then when we go into spring i wear jeans a lot more so yeah i'm always on the hunt for a good new pair so i've got four different brands to share the jeans with you today i've got zara i've got asos um i've got h&m and i've got levi's oh i've got five because i've got misguided as well so yeah, five brands of jeans to share with you. Um, I've also, all of these jeans are high-waisted, but they have got different leg lengths. So I've got straight leg, I've got skinny leg, I've got mum style, um, and then I've got some split jeans as well. Um, just to um, mention before I start this video, I am 5'5". Five five. Um, I wear between a six and an eight, so I've got some size sixes here and some size eight. So yeah, we'll see which ones fit the best. And hopefully this will be a good little guide on what jet denim you can buy for spring okay so these are all the jeans that i'm going to be trying on with you guys today so i've got some from zara here we have h&m we have asos and misguided so yeah a few different colors in there and yeah i'm super excited to try all of these on like i said some of these are my like current staples um but they are in stock now but quite a lot of these are new so yeah let's hope i find a new staple pair of jeans okay so i am going to be trying on the jeans with this same top as i feel like you can see then how the different jeans fit like if some are more high-waisted if some are a bit more lower um this top is actually a new i actually really really like it it's kind of got ruche de like detailing up the side and this is the type of top that i wear with jeans all the time in the spring um it's from h&m so i'll obviously leave the link down below so first pair of jeans these are the zara mum jeans now as you can see they are super high waisted which i really like these are an eight um what i like about these jeans is that they're fitted around my bum and things like that they have got i have got quite a little bit of room on the waist there as you can see but when you sit down in these jeans they do go a lot tighter so it's definitely better to size up if you're between sizes um, as you can see the fit on my leg is a really really nice fit it's tight but not too tight and then they go down into kind of like a skinny um skinny jean but not too tight there's obviously a bit of gap around the ankles which again i really really like i think this sits really really well with trainers um, and also boots like I said, these are more of a structured denim, so if you are between sizes, then I would recommend sizing up. But I feel like the fit of them is great, and yeah, they just go with so many different things. So this is the same, but in the black, and I always find that different colour jeans fit differently. Like, I feel like these fit completely different to the blue ones. They're a lot more bigger on the waist, as you can see there, but that's fine. Like I said, they do kind of feel quite tight when you sit down. But yeah, I just thought I'd show you the black on because it's good to see them on in a different colour. And I'll just try the light blue ones in these as well. Okay, and this is the colour which is my most recent purchase, which is why I've still got the tag on because I've not actually worn these out yet. And these are the light blue colour. They just fit so nicely and you can obviously like tuck t-shirts into them, wear them with crop tops. I love the high waist on them and then just to show the fit on the bum and stuff really fitted on the bum and the legs and then just a little bit beggar on the calves which is like the perfect style of jean for me obviously you don't need every single color in the mum jeans just for me they were like a jean for the first time in ages that i found that fit me perfectly so i just got them in three different colors because i wear them all the time but let's see if some of the other newbies trump up to be my favorite okay so this next pair of jeans is also from zara and they are called the slim jean now these ones are a lot lot softer denim they're really really soft denim they're super super nice um these ones are these are 27.99 and i'm pretty the mum jeans are also 27.99 sorry i forgot to mention that but most jeans in zara are around that price again they're super high waisted they fit my waist perfectly they're not actually as big on the waist as the mum jeans they fit really really well 
Um, these have obviously got rips in them just for something a little bit different. I would say the length in these is slightly longer. You can see there it's kind of like bulking up on my foot but I feel like these jeans would be a really good like more smarter pair of jeans to wear with like a pair of heels and then you could obviously dress them down as well in the day. I'll just show you the fit of them from behind. So very similar to the mum jean but like I said they're a lot softer denim and a lot more comfortable. Let's do the sit down test. Yeah, they're so much more comfortable to sit down in compared to the mum jeans. Um, but yeah, these are a really great addition. I love how they're kind of like a mid-wash blue as well. Yeah, I feel like these will be a good addition to my jean collection. And like I said, I think they'll be like a little bit more smarter. I feel like if you wear these with... I tried on this white shirt with a tie and I feel like these jeans with that white shirt and like a pair of white heels would be really nice for like a more dressed up outfit in the summer. Okay, so these ones again are from Zara. These ones are called the Split Skinny Jean. Again, in a UK eight, these are $25.99. So, first impressions, I love how high-waisted these are. I love the deep colour blue, like I don't have anything like this darker blue currently in my jean collection. These are a lot more of a skinnier leg, um, obviously as they're a skinny jean, so they're fitted all the way down. And they go into a split. Now, as you can see, I'm obviously 5'5", five five. the length on these are quite long, so I am actually just going to put some um, like platform trainers on now, just to show you how they fit with trainers, because if you're shorter than me, then these might be quite long for you. Okay, so now I've got trainers on, they actually look really, really nice. Obviously, they have got a little bit of a ruffle over the top of the trainer, so if you're taller than me, these will probably suit you a lot more. Although I am 5'5", five five, my legs are a lot shorter, like I've got a really long body. Um, so yeah, they would probably sit more better on someone that's just got like a normal proportion, legs and stomach. But me, I just have like a really long torso and short legs but yeah i do really like these um i feel like they're just something a little bit different to your normal every pair of jean um again the material of them is super super soft um really stretchy sit down perfectly really really comfy so yeah i'll just show you them from behind they might drag quite a bit on the floor actually, mightn't they? So yeah, I'm a little bit undecided about these. I do really, really like the style, um, but I don't know if for me, they're just gonna be that bit too long. Okay, so next is a pair of jeans from Misguided. Now these have been in my collection for a couple of years now, um, and Misguided always bring them out. They're like a staple jean for them. Um, what I would say is these are definitely not, I feel like they give me a little bit of a camel. <laughs> They're definitely not as um, high-waisted as the Zara ones. Absolutely love the color. I think it looks great with like white tops, like white hoodies and like a neutral outfit. They're super soft as well. Like I can't tell you, they don't even really feel like a jean. Um, they're super, super comfortable. As you can see, all the way down the leg, they've got lots and lots of rips. So I feel like they're a really, really cool outfit for like spring, summer. Um, I really love them. I feel like the the length of them for me is perfect. Obviously, if you're a little bit shorter, you can always do a turn up. And then if you're a bit taller than me, they will probably just sit more on the ankle. Um, I'm pretty sure that Misguided sometimes do them in leg length. So if they do, obviously, you can order them according to your size. I am wearing an eight. Waist fits great, not too big at all fitted on the bum again which I really like and then just baggier on the legs but yeah these are a really really great pair of jeans and I'm pretty sure they're really really affordable as well I can't, can't quite remember the price of them because like I said I have had them for a couple of years now but I mean I've had them for two years and the fit and the structure of them is still really really great they've obviously been washed multiple times and yeah I can never get rid of these I just love the color of them and I love the extreme rips and it's just something a little bit more edgier to my jean wardrobe okay so these ones are a little bit of a fail I got them in a six because usually in H&M I always have to size down they fit perfectly on my legs which is strange but I just cannot do the zip up I just cannot do that the waist and the zip up whereas usually it's my legs that are bigger than my waist like my waist is like usually definitely a six so yeah kind of strange definitely if you're between sizes definitely size up in these i feel like they fit really nicely like on my bum and stuff which is going to be a bit annoying because i feel like the eight they might be not as nice on the legs and then fitted on the waist i'm not sure but yeah these are really really soft denim i absolutely love the color i think i'm definitely going to order the eight just to see because I really really like the style and I think I'll get quite a lot of wear out of this colour. Obviously they're similar colour to the misguided ones but obviously 
The misguided ones have loads of rips, so I feel like these are a more smarter pair of jeans. Like, I can imagine them looking really nice with, like, heels and, like, a white blouse to dress up in in the summer. And then, obviously, they'll go really nicely with trainers. But, yeah, I'm kind of annoyed, actually, because the fit on my legs is, like, perfect, but it's just so tight on my waist. I literally only just managed to do them up. So yeah, it's strange, because as you can see in all the eights and the jeans, the waist are usually a lot bigger, but it's different for the H&M ones, so definitely bear that in mind. Um, yeah, I've got another pair of blue jeans in a slightly different shape from H&M, so I'll try these on now, but I feel like I'm going to have the same issue with the waist. I think it was literally just that pair of jeans, that style, because these ones are a size 6 and they literally fit like a glove, they're perfect. They've got a little bit of give on the waist, they fit really, really nicely on the legs. These ones are called the high waist mum jean ankle length. I mean, they're not... I mean, they're a little bit ankle length, but I've got short legs, so they're kind of like a full length jean on me, so just bear that in mind if you're slightly taller. Um, I love that it's got like a distressed hem on the bottom. Really, really soft denim. Sit down is absolutely fine as well. Um, they fit really, really great actually. So I'm kind of sad that the sand don't, but I guess they're a slightly different fit. Um, like, as you can see, fit really nicely on the bum, legs and calves as well. Um, I think these are a 17 99 so if you're looking for a little bit more of a cheaper jean, then I would 100% recommend going for these. I'm pretty sure they do them in all different washes as well. I really like this darker blue wash though, slightly different to anything that I've got in my wardrobe right now, and they do fit a lot differently to the, um, to the Zara mum jeans. Like I said, these are a lot more softer. And yeah, I really, really like these. Okay, so this next pair of jeans are from Levi's. Again, these are a really, really light wash denim. These are a lot lighter than the Zara light denim ones as well. Oh my God, why are they giving me a bit of a camel? <laughs> That's not good, is it? Right, I'll stand like this. <laughs> um, lost my train of thought. So these aren't as high-waisted as the other pairs of jeans that I've tried on. As you can see, the difference between where they fall. The other ones fall somewhere around here. Um, these are really grey soft denim. So these, did I say this? These are called the wedgie straight. I have these in 2530, which I think is the equivalent to a size 6. Um, I ha I'd actually tried on the 8 in these when I got them, and the 8 was just way too big. Um, as you can see, the 6 even has quite a lot of room. They're really, really stretchy. Fitted all the way down, and these are a straight leg. So as you can see, they do come out a little bit more at the ankle, so just bear that in mind. I feel like... These look a lot better with like a flat form style trainer, like a Veja or like my Knockwell trainers. They just look a little bit better just because they do go out on the ankle. They don't quite suit like a runner trainer just as much. Um, so yeah, just to show you behind again, really fitted on the bum and then a little bit more baggier on the waist. So with Levi's, they can be quite expensive. I got these for around £50, so obviously they're the more expensive jean in this haul that I'm showing you today, but um, yeah, definitely keep an eye out on them. If they say £80, like don't buy them for £80 because they have sales all the time, and I think they always do good student discount as well. But yeah, I really, really like these jeans. Okay, so another pair of Levi's. These are a mid-wash jean, and these ones are in the style rib cage straight. Now, even though both of the, the ones that I showed before and these ones are both called straight, look at the difference in the ankle. So these are a lot more of a wide leg jean, but again, they're just slightly different to something that I have had in my jean wardrobe. Um, I actually got these last year, and I lived in them. They're literally so comfortable. I love that they've got just the one little rip on the side, and they look really nice with any trainer. So yeah, they're just slightly different if you're not wanting like a slim jean, um, but they're obviously really fitted on the top, which I like, and then just go out a little bit on the bottom, but don't go out into like a boot cut style jean. They fit really, really well on the bum. Now I actually have these ones in a 26, not a 25. They are slightly bigger on the waist, but they just fit really nicely on my legs. Again, these were probably around the £80 mark, but I again got them in the sale for like £50, I think. So they actually do these in so many different colours now to when I bought them last year. So you've got so many different varieties to choose from, which is good. These are a great everyday jean. They're just super, super soft. And I actually wore them like round the house quite a lot in the lockdown last year, um, just because they are really, really comfortable. They don't dig in at all when you sit down. They're just super, super comfy. So yeah, that is those. Okay, so the last two pairs of jeans are from ASOS. And I have to say, these have 
were like my long standing favourites for a long time. I'm pretty sure I have had these around four or five years and they still do the same style um, on ASOS now. These are the Farley Mum High Waisted jeans and I think Slim's in there somewhere as well. These ones are super high waisted, they're probably the highest out of them all. Again, they're a little bit big on the waist. These are an ape. I can't tell you how comfortable these jeans are. As you can see, they're more of a skinny leg, I think, rather than a mum jean. They've got the two rips on the side. And what I like about these as well is that they've never got bigger. Like, don't you hate the ones where you wear them and the rip just stretches? I think because these are a really stretchy denim, the rip just stays the same size, which I love. And I also like the fact that they've got the distressed hem. These literally... These jeans go with everything. They go with heels, they go with trainers, they go with boots. They're such a good staple pair. And yeah, they fit really, really nicely as well. They do do them in an array of colours, so you're not, don't have to get them in blue. There's also like black and then a light blue, and then there's also ones without rips as well. I can't quite remember the price for these, but I think they're around the £30 mark. So again, really, really affordable. And yeah, I live in these jeans. They're great. I will never, ever chuck them out because they just fit me perfectly. Okay, so the last pair, these are from ASOS, but from St Stradarius. <laughs> I can never flip and say them, but these are a black skinny jean and they've just got like the distressed hem on the bottom. I feel like you always need like a black skinny jean in your wardrobe. They're just um, really, really smart and good to wear like in the evening. I don't really wear these ones in the day as much um they're definitely more of an evening jean for me like with heels and stuff but again the fits really really great on them these ones are a size 8 but i'm pretty sure they're so affordable like 19 pounds which i think is really good again they're a really really soft denim these are an 8 but they are um smaller on the waist for me so true to size and yeah i really like them i do actually need to just kind of trim <laughs> the distressed hem a bit because it's going a bit crazy and a bit kind of like Halloween-y but yeah I'll give those a trim but yeah like I said these are more of a smarter jean for me um I wear them a lot more in the winter with like boots and stuff but they're definitely more of like a evening jean rather than a daytime jean okay guys that is the end of this week's video I hope you guys really enjoyed it and gave you a little bit more of an insight into what jeans are out there at the moment if you did please give this video a thumbs up and subscribe down below and I shall see you in the next one on Thursday bye guys